Hello there, this is Jemmy, and today I'll be showing you on how to install the Twilight Forest mod for Minecraft 1.1, made by Benimatic, I believe I pronounced that right. But basically what this mod does is adds a new dimension to the game, so instead of having the end and the ne nether, you will also have the Twilight Forest, which adds many more biomes, like this water one here, just more trees, and just more stuff to explore. This just adds ravines as well. It has new structures, new mobs, mazes. It's a really enjoyable mod, and I highly recommend that you download this mod and play it today. So basically, the four main mods you need is Mod Loader, Mod Loader MP, Audio Mod, the Twilight Forest Mod, and I also recommend too many items if you don't want to do it the legit way and stuff. It's not that hard, but Finding a diamond, that's all you the main item is the diamond. So, you do is go down to your start, 2% app data percent sign, not money sign, percent. Click <coughs> Minecraft and then into bin. Find your Minecraft and open that with WinRot Archiver or 7zip. You can close this down, you don't need that. Just drag it to this one side. First thing you do is delete the meta INF don't want that stops your mod from working. So first thing is mod loader, drag and drop, click OK, then mod loader MP, drag and drop, click OK, and then audio mod, drag and drop, click OK, then the Twilight Forest mod. All these files you drag and drop all of them straight in there not over a folder make sure it's just over the classes and then if you're installing too many items just drag and drop all the files as well and then click OK now you should be done open your .minecraft folder no, not .minecraft your minecraft itself hopefully this is quick Click a login and then it seems to be working. Yep, it's worked because we haven't got a black screen. Just go into a world. Any world will do it. You don't have to create a new world. But it's quicker if I just go into a separate empty world. So, what you need to do to make this portal is when I stop lagging. So make sure the settings are that'd be why. Just turn that off, that up, that up. Right, okay. You find a grassy area. And just get some of this stuff. You need two waters to make an infinite source block. You need one diamond. Right, okay. Dig out a four by four hole. And um, that chicken's going to annoy me. Put water in each corner, so you've got a block, and then surround it by natural stuff. Make sure you put the corners as well. You have to have the corners done. Otherwise, it won't work at all. Just make sure you get everything, even the corners. And there seems to be a lag just because I'm screening. Alright, so you've got everything recorded. Throw a thing in. I believe I've got every corner. Maybe it can't have mushrooms. I think it's because I still got the dirt block in there. Alright, throw that in. I have got every corner, haven't I? There should be an explosion, and then it should basically kill you. Now you got to have one of every type. So I don't know why this has not worked. It clearly says down here. It also has a picture of what it should look like. There we go. 
forest, make a two by two shallow pool, four squares of water in a grassy area, blah blah blah, surround it time with natural stuff, yep. Maybe it's because I haven't put enough mushrooms around. So let me cheat because this is what the too many items is for. Get rid of the grass. Oh man, that could be annoying. Ah, okay. Go that side, put a yellow flower there. Get rid of the grass in total. <laughs> Alright. Q key. Still not worked. What do I keep picking up? It's trying to work, but it isn't. Right. Okay, scratches people. Let's try in a bigger area. What about over here? Big enough? Yeah. We need our two water again. Natural stuff. Grass on the outside, flower, flower. Need more flowers. Get a yellow flower there, flower there. Um, now let's put down the mushrooms. course that would happen. Mushroom, mushroom, flower, then <laughs> put the mushroom, oh. mushroom down, all surrounded. Maybe we have to do it the proper way, the painful way of getting lots of water blocks. So the there we go. I didn't think it was because I was in a big enough area. So there you go. It's worked. Let's jump in and show you. I'm sorry it took a while to show off at first, but see entering the twilight forest. Building terrain. Slowly, so it may take a while. Alright, come on, you can do it quicker. This will probably be about seven, eight minute long tutorial for something so short, but that's because it didn't work the first time, even though it should have. So all the links for the mods will be in the description below. So please click them links to get all the mods, and please subscribe to my channel for more tutorials and Minecraft playthroughs. I'm also looking out for more mods to do tutorials on. If you guys find any of them hard to install then please send me a message and I will do them uh, yep yeah, I know the performance has gone slow it's not my fault let's quickly open this back up and just enjoy the pictures as you can see big trees tree tree houses ideas weird slime looking thing, a maze and just really cool stuff. You get these glow glow bugs I believe they're called. And as you can see this is entering. I'm sorry this is taking forever. But just skip some of the video. Oh, as it's building a train, as you can see, you get your wolves in here. Oh no, let's go slow on that. Let's go to creative. And as you can see, you could say it looks like normal world. As you can see, you've got these glow bugs here that I was just talking about. Basically torches, but they look like bugs. That's a tuny one. You can just see it just fly around. 
it's a really cool place just because what there is and i'm sorry if it lags lag spikes i know it's annoying so there you go it has su su successfully worked so please comment below what if you want me to do more tutorials and thank you guys for watching and 